So what you need to do is go to your settings. You need to create an audio group, which I did down here. And in that audio group, you need to put your Google Home and anything else that you want to play in it. You can do just a Google Home and it will work. I have a Google Home and a Chromecast, but I'm going to show you something after I do the Google Home that goes with the Chromecast. All right, so anyway, so to do that, go back to your main page, go to your profile, your account settings, and go to mirror device. And when you go to mirror device, I'm going to go ahead and disconnect. When you go to mirror device, it's going to ask you if you want to cast your screen or your audio. So um, I'm going to hit cast. I'm going to find my audio group, which was called YouTube group. And now I'm going to go closer to my Google Home. And while I'm doing that, I'm going to find a YouTube video with audio that I want to play. And the music you hear is from the Google Home. And if I hit pause, the music stops. Alright, so now I'm going to hit pause again. And let me show you another trick. So if you do that, now you decide you actually want to um, show the same thing on your Chromecast screen, but you don't want to show the video mm -hmm. from, from the YouTube video. So you can actually leave this on your um, ambient mode, your Chromecast, and when you hit um, mirror screen and audio, it will change this to say audio mirroring, and if you notice it says YouTube group. So I am going to go back to YouTube, I'll start playing this music again and let me see if I can get back to my camera so you can see it and now it's playing through my TV so you could actually use this for slideshows put your own photos in put them on like 10 second intervals and play music through YouTube if you don't have it from anywhere else that's how I did it. Thanks. See you later. Bye.